Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Juice Baseball Channel, and welcome back to episode number one of the Juice Career Mode. That is right. We are going to be doing a road to the show with the Juice. I started one last season in MLB The Show 23, and I kind of just got, I don't know, I don't want to say bored with it, but I was a, I think I, I did a two-way prospect pitcher and, and some sort of position player. I think it might have been shortstop or maybe second base. I can't remember exactly, but we did a, a two-way player, and I just, I don't, I don't really know. I didn't really... I didn't really vibe with it for some reason. Hopefully that doesn't happen again this year. I think another thing is the fact that we don't I didn't get called up as quick as I may have wanted to, and that's on me for the most part not being able to hit the ball very well. <laughs> Hopefully that changes this year. But today we are starting anew. We are going to be back on MLB The Show 24 with a road to the show. So I hope you guys are excited. I have already built the player we are going to be this out of all the the um road to the show players i've made in my time on mlb the show this one could be the most i don't want to say accurate because i don't it's as close as it's going to be to look like me without actually me being scanned fully by san diego studios into the game basically is what i'm saying so yes i did get scanned into the game by using the MLB The Show companion app face scan and here is the reveal. Boom! The juice has been born in MLB The Show 24. We can get into the looks in a second but I am rocking um, juice. I have the unfortunate audio for the first name is going to be Jules because uh, obviously there is no juice in the <laughs> in the uh, the database for MLB The Show. Rocket number 24 for the kid, Ken Griffey Jr., the kid. One of my favorite players growing up. We're going to be right-handed, right-handed, because that's uh, that's what I am. We're going to be from the central region and from Ohio. That's what I am as well. And if we get into the... We'll get into the position I'm playing in a second. Let's get into the look so you can see me a little bit better. Here I am 6'4", 210, which is pretty darn accurate, if we're being totally honest. I am actually 6'4", in real life. And let's just say I'm maybe a little bit heavier than 210 right now, but we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> so 210 is uh, is where I put it. I think I look pretty good. The face scan looks, honestly, pretty decent. And here it is up close without the glasses on. Obviously, I wear glasses. If you've watched my main channel, you know I, I wear glasses. But I feel like this is, this is as accurate of a face scan as I'm ever going to get unless I actually get put into the game by San Diego Studios, which will never happen. But this is a pretty darn accurate face scan of your boy from the companion app. It took a little bit of work. I had to figure out the right lighting, and I think I actually figured it out. So we've got ourselves the face scan. We got the eye color. We got the beard rocking. We got the hairstyle. Now, the hairstyle is a fun thing because the hairstyle can change on a dime. Like, if we're in a playoff run in October, we might need to change the hairstyle to get some some good juju going we might need to grow playoff beard who knows there's some fun things that we can do with the uh the customization in this one we get hopefully hopefully a little bit deeper but i like the way this came out i think it personally looks like me <laughs> it's like i said it's as close as i'm ever gonna get to a face skin looking like me in the game without actually being in the game so we've obviously got the uh the beard the face the glasses I've got my necklace on. The hairstyle is pretty close. My hair is a little bit shorter on the sides, but this one was as close as I could find to my actual hairstyle. Um, but yeah, that's what we're looking like there. Obviously, we got the glasses on because, you know, your boy can't see without the glasses. And I went with gold frames because I thought that might be pretty funny. <laughs> I have like, I think they're like black or gray frames that I'm wearing in real life. Uh, but we got the gold frames. And the orange accents, because, you know, your boy has to be orange for the juice. And then we got gold accented shoes. I thought that going, I wanted to go all white on the shoes. And then I was like, you know what? That might be a little too white. So, <laughs> funny. <laughs> might be a little too white. That might be a little too of the color white. So, I wanted to accent it with something. I thought, you know what? I got the gold frames. Might as well rock the gold outline on the shoes as well. So, that's what we're rocking with the shoes. So your boy is ready to go. The equipment and style you can see, uh, I've got the 
the chain, I've got the compression sleeve long on the left, I've got the compression sleeve short on the right, I got the two wristbands, I've got a darker colored glove because when I was playing baseball back in middle school and stuff, and almost into high school, I didn't play in high school, but when I was in elementary and middle school and stuff, I had a darker colored glove, so I went with a little bit of a darker glove on this one, and here is what I look like as a catcher because drum roll please we are gonna be a catcher for this year of road to the show i've never done a catcher road to the show so i was like you know what i kind of want to see what happens with a catcher road to the glo the road to the show so we are going to be a catcher in road to the show 24 i'm super excited about it i can show you my batting stance here in a second this is what we're going to be rocking with the batting stance as you can see i i tried to get it as close as i could to my real life batting stance obviously i'm a right-handed batter um i haven't actually played baseball or swung a baseball bat in a long time probably at least maybe four or five years maybe even longer than that so uh, just basing off of what i remember my stance looking like or what it would look like if i was to play today i feel like i would look something similar to this maybe a little bit less bat spin or bat uh, wiggle with the hands and stuff i don't i didn't really do that too much when i was playing but I definitely got pretty low to the ground with the hips, hips, and the knees bent like that. So that's pretty, pretty much my batting stance with some slight variations if I were to do it today. So that's what we're rocking with. Um, well, I'll save the home run animation for the first time we hit a home run and all that kind of stuff. So everything is ready to go. I'm super excited about this because I, I think I wouldn't be as excited about it if my face scan wasn't as good or if I didn't like my face scan as much, but I actually really enjoy my face scan. I think it looks pretty darn good, pretty darn accurate to what I look like in real life. So I'm excited about this. I'm ready to go. I don't know what's going to happen. I know you can do a female road to the show and a male road to the show, and they have different kind of branches, storylines you can take for something. So we're obviously going to take the male storyline because this is about me. So... I'm super excited. I have no idea what's going to happen. I don't, I, I know that there's like three different combine games you have to play in or something like that. I think that's, I, I've seen something on, along those lines, but that's about as far as my knowledge goes on any new additions to Road to the Show. So I'm super excited about it. I hope you guys are too. If you guys are excited for another year of MLB The Show 24 on the channel, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, join the Juice Club, and let's start my career. Let me get these headphones on. I don't have my headphones on right now. Oh, we got a little bit of cutscene? Okay. Oh, Micah Davis. Hey, Juice, this is Micah Davis from the MLB Scouting Bureau, and I have some exciting news for you. Oh, what's the exciting news? We would like to invite you to this year's MLB Draft Combine. Are you interested? Uh, sure, dog. What happens if I say, can he? Oh, I'm not sure. I thought that said no. Can you tell me more about the Combine? Thanks, but I'll take my chance in the draft. Ooh, I wonder what happens if you do that. Absolutely, I'll be there, dog. Nice, glad to hear that. It'll be a huge opportunity to show what you can do before the draft. I will do my best. That is true. I will do my best. Okay, we'll be in touch with your agent to make arrangements. Have a good day. I'm going to have a great day, Micah. Thank you for saying that. Welcome back to MLB Tonight. I'm Robert Flores here alongside with former GM Dan O'Dowd and baseball researcher Sarah Langs. MLB Draft Combine is coming up. It's always an exciting time. Dan, what can we expect? What are you going to be looking for? Well, Robert, for me, this is one of the most important events on the baseball calendar each and every year. If you look at it, all the clubs get a chance to answer the questions they have on the players, and then all the best players in the country get to showcase their skills in front of 30 clubs. So, I mean, I'm just really excited to see what's going to happen. Sarah, it's a four-day event. It's held at Chase Field in Phoenix. What advanced metrics can players and viewers expect to see? I mean, there's so much data with this event, part of why I love it so much, and I've been there every time this has been held, so glad we're back again. For pitchers, you've got pitch velocity, you've got spin rate, you've got extension. For hitters, we have your exit velocity, launching, and of course, the distance on those home runs. Well, congratulations, and good luck to all the young athletes as they continue their journey to hopefully one day land in the big leagues. All right, that was pretty interesting. Day one, showcase your talent at the draft combine. Ooh, look at the boys. Oh, I'm ready to go. I'm a top prospect, dog. There I am, the catcher. I look kind of hilarious with the glasses on, but I like it. I like it. Ooh, look at the look at the boy. The boy's ready to go. 
What if we get drafted by the Diamondbacks? That'd be pretty interesting. All right. Ooh, okay. We're, ooh, we answered a question. What's happening here? Okay, let's see how you swing the bat. Good hitting requires rhythm and timing, so I just suggest you take some warm-up swings before your scouting evaluation begins, if I can read. All right, this is the first time <laughs> I've played MLB The Show this season, so we mostly want to see you make solid contact, but we do want to see what kind of pop you got. I did pick power, by the way, if you're wondering. I did pick power. So let's see what we can got. What we, what we can got? What we can do here. Put the ball in play in the war. Oh, that one fell crispy off the bat. Talk about some pop. I'm only pressing normal swing here. I might toss in a few. I might toss in a few uh, power swings. Here's a power swing. Let's see if we got any pop. Oh, that was off the wall. 97 velo. Okay, didn't put that one in play. I got nine chances, eight chances left. I'm going to go back to the normal swing here. Ooh, I didn't hit it that hard. But that one goes for probably a double. That's probably extra bases. I got a B grade right now. Ooh, that one felt crispy. Crispiness like a chicken taco. And that one was uh, extra bases as well. Six chances left. Oh. <laughs> Your boy is swinging for the fences. That one is almost over the wall. I don't have exactly Barry Bonds level power right now, but I am uh, I am cooking with some of these long balls. That one's not going to go to the wall or go to the over the wall, unfortunately. Unless it does. Oh, right off the bottom of the wall. I've got a grade for a B right now. That one's got some movement. Go over the wall. Oh, it's just not there. It's oh, I got mo I moved my A gr or my grade to an A. I'm just not getting the the pop that I need. One more chance. I'm gonna go power swing here. Ah! <laughs> I struck out and I moved to a B. No. <laughs> oh, I swung and missed and I moved to a B grade. That's upsetting. All right, now we're back to a catcher. In catcher drill, I gotta take the headphones off here. I gotta turn the announce or the commentators off in catcher drills we want to see you throw you're going to get a chance to throw out some runners and show off your arm strength and accuracy all right let's go see what we can do here dog throw it a second i'm ready he's only got 25 steel he's a beanbag oh i made oh, oops <laughs> i uh, i didn't i didn't do that very well okay first one though uh boom gunned out get out of here get out of here throw it a second again gone out oh i'm gunning him down call me the next jorge posada i am gunning him down like it's nobody's business oh he was out by a mile he could have he could have got 99 speed he was gone all right we got five chances to throw people out why is it starting me so up high oh he was out by an absolute mile did you see how far that was how far he was from that Four chances left. Gun down again. Oh, it's crispy. I am a pure catcher. I'm as catcher as it gets. Catcher in the rye, dog. You try to get me a third? Oh my god, you shouldn't even have taken off. You should not have even taken off. You're a scrub. Trying to steal on third. Get out of here. Look at how far he is. He didn't have a chance. Ellie De La Cruz wouldn't have a chance against this arm. I got a cannon. A bazooka. These fools don't stand a chance. Look how far. He didn't even get on the ground before he was in his glove. That is perfect, dog. Perfect. Couldn't have gone better. Now what do we got? We've got quite a clinic you put on today, Juice. Wow. Oh, that's good. That's good. Keep showing us what you can do in these games coming up in the next few days, and you'll put yourself in great spot for the draft. We, who knows, you might even earn an invite to be at the draft in person. I didn't know that was a thing. Mind you, there's a lot of talent in this year's class, so don't expect anything from just one good day. Rest up, and we'll see you tomorrow. Oh, I, per I moved up to projected round 15 now, and it looks like MLB teams that are interested in me are the Red Sox, Nationals, Rays, Guardians, White Sox, my hometown Reds, Obviously, the Guardians are hometown too, but I'm a fan of the Reds. The Rockies and the Angels. Interesting. Okay. Unfortunately, I couldn't get an A grade on my hitting. 
That's just kind of stupid, though. What's Draft Combine leaderboard? Ooh, what is this? Longest hit to, uh, distance today. Andres Gonzalez hit a 426, but I hit a 407. And it looks like Babe Ruth has the longest home run in MLB history with a 575. All right, dog, whatever. What's what's this one over here? Hardest exit velo? Oh, mine was down 103. I didn't hit the ball very fast, <laughs> apparently. This is pretty cool. I like this. What do we got over here? We got contact. My current contact is 45. My power is 66. It's projected to go to 75 to 85. My MLB comparison is Aaron Judge? Dog, that's crazy. <laughs> My speed is 35. We might we not, might not be stealing a lot of bases here in uh, this MLB the show, but or this road to the show, but that's that's okay. How do I uh, how do I go to the next game? Do I click what do I click here? Oh, I guess I just have to return to the clubhouse. Okay, let's return to the clubhouse and see what happens. Oh, we got day one showcase. All right, dog. Let's let's get in this. I'm excited. I am super excited. Oh, here we go. Oh, I got a notification. Okay. Uh, what's this say? Oh, play style. Uh, oh, create a play style. Wait, no, I don't need to create a play. What? What? Oh, that's okay. I get it. I get it. So let me change my skills here. I've got sparking slugger. Hardly know her. Slick Slugger, hardly know her. And Speedy Slugger, hardly know her. So, spar uh, Sparking Slugger. What is that? Why'd they make the plus and minus so hard to read? It looks like cat scratch writing. Uh, so, it looks like my fielding goes up with the Slick Slugger. But Speedy Slugger seems to be the best one, so I might as well have that one see all attributes so i've got 66 power versus righties and lefties i got a potential look at the boy tasks and rewards what's that oh this is like the packs and stuff perks do i have any perks Ooh, i do well i might as well equip power one and then probably probably contact one as well because we don't really need fielding or speed right now i'm gonna equip contact one once we unlock these other ones then we'll add some cooler ones and then bat well, I've only got a gold bat. That gives me plus five power and contact. Yes, sir. Uh, well, I had another one there. I had it in equipment. Uh, oh, it's chest protector. Ooh, plus four blocking on a diamond elite chest plate. Or chest protector. And I must have something else. A ritual item. Uh, respect the tools. Plus five vision, plus six discipline, and plus four reaction. That'll be nice to have. And then it looks like I've got something else in the locker open what's this do oh i have a gold pack okay might as well open a gold pack oh came out of the controller that was crazy uh well i'm probably not playing an ultimate team right now so i might as well pick something that'll help me let's pick the the shoes because i don't have any shoes yet so all right that was that was cool but now i can add those shoes so if i find my cleats but that'll ruin my my freaking uh cleats that i got on right now but they give me plus nine speed, plus nine steel. Oh, I'm, I forget about that. I'm putting those cleats on. Plus nine to speed that I don't have very much speed already. My batting is above average. My fielding is above average and my running is above average. That's nice. <laughs> That's nice to know. So what happens now? Talking to somebody. I'm a 62 overall. Uh, practice field not open during the combine. Looks like some settings. Okay. So I'm gonna we're going to load into the game and I'm super excited to get this first game underway. I'll see you guys in there. Welcome to day two of the MLB Draft Combine at Chase Field in Arizona. I'm Ben Gelman, and today we'll get to see some of the brightest prospects out there go head-to-head -head and put their skills on display to boost their draft stock. We're just about ready to get started. All right, here we go. I low-key want to get drafted number one, or like the first round, because I want to... Uh, That's not my fault. I didn't even pick the pitch. But it looks like they're coming home to me. Tag him. Oh, I wasn't ready for this. Oh, I was not ready for that. That's okay. I don't know if I would have tagged him anyway. <laughs> now I know. Now I know. I've got the traditional stuff that I like to use. Taking the pitch. Taking the pitch. Let's see what we got here. We got an 0-1 count. What can we do? Give me something to... Cook! All right, that wasn't amazing. I'm cooking, I'm cooking, I'm trying. That wasn't a good start. That's okay. I kind of want to see what happens if you get called to the... Oh, base is loaded? Really? What is this pitcher doing? This pitcher sucks. Oh, that's mine. 
I don't like this though. I don't know where the ball's at. Okay, I got it. But I where'd my? I thought I just changed that to the. I guess I have to change that to the ball or the mode specific. I don't know. But I thought I had the drifting ball like I normally have. Bottom of the fifth. Ooh, that was a good one. I probably should have swung at that. All right, Bartolo. Give me something to cook. I was a little bit early. Remember, this is the first time I've played MLB The Show uh, this year. It's been the first time I've played it this year, so... Gotta find the timing. I'll get to it, though. Once we get started in, in some of these games in the regular season and stuff. Okay, a little bit, little bit early. A little bit early on that one. If this pitcher gives me something that I can actually uh, get a hold of... Ah, it wasn't really that great, but at least I got good contact on it. The pitcher's out. He's afraid of me. He's afraid of what I'm going to do. Daniel Fong. He's bunting on the dog? You dare bunt on the dog? You can't bunt on me. Who do you think you are? Oh, he got that? I don't know. <laughs> it said the announcer said that he beat me by a step, but I don't know. You can't throw on me. Oh, here we go. Yeah! I got decent contact on that. It's going to be a bloop single. I'll take that. Nice little bloop single. Now, I'm not the fastest guy in the world, although 60 speed for a catcher is not that bad. There's definitely catches that are <laughs> lower than that. Uh, that's going to be a little grounder to second. Double play option. Yeah, they got the double play. This team sucks. I know we're only in the draft combine, but trade me. <laughs> All right, a single in the second. Ooh, okay, little little runners in scoring position, little ducks in the pond action. Let me get something in the outfield here. I was cranking in the, the warm-ups. I was cranking. Crank that soldier boy. Bottom of the ninth. I didn't even clock that. Bottom of the ninth. Ah! They got I don't like that they changed the way the scoreboard shows the inning, the half inning, because it's hard to read the bottom of the ninth. I didn't even clock that we were in the bottom. Ooh, he tried to get me inside. Tried to choke me up there. You're not going to choke me. I'll choke you. Oh, that wasn't great. It said good contact, but... Oh! I mean, I advanced the runner and got a fielder's choice. That didn't feel like great contact. Steel situation. I'm 60 speed. I got 60 speed. They think I'm gonna I'm gonna steal. What is this? <laughs> no, I'm not stealing. If he puts something in the outfield, I'll just keep going around. Yo, he's gonna strike out, isn't he? He's totally gonna strike out. I just know it. Come on, your Bina. Put something in the outfield. Give me a chance to tie this game up. If you put it deep enough. Wow. Full count, two outs. Now it's a steal situation. Because there's nothing else to go. Either a walk or a hit. Go. It's going to be a strikeout. That's how we lose? Oh, the CPU teammates suck. We moved up to projected round 13, and we got the Marlins, the Tigers, and the Pirates now involved in us. I'll take that. Let's get to game number two, and hopefully have a little bit of better performance than one for four. It's day three of the MLB Draft Combine here in Arizona. Another chance for these young prospects to impress in a high stakes environment. I'm Ben Gelman, and we're just about set for today's games to begin. All right, here we go. We got Jose Cardona on the mound. A runner on first and two outs. Uh, I pressed the wrong button, dog. I'm going to be simple with you. Or I'm going to be straight with you. That's going to hurt me. I pressed the wrong button. I wasn't paying attention to the steal situation. That's on me. That's okay. We're back. I don't know if I was an asset on that play. I'm thinking I'm going to use a little bit of... Power? Nah, because when I was hitting the power swings in the warm-ups, I wasn't really 
uh, wasn't really hitting them. I'm gonna hit that baseball though. Mm, really? That one didn't get down? That was a good contact swing too. I felt good off that one. That was right down the middle too. <sighs> Man. Come on, I gotta find some power here. I gotta find some power. No, I'm not swinging at that. I got too good a vision for that, dog. Too good a vision. Not gonna get me. But I'm gonna need something a little bit juicier than that. Come on. What are we doing here? I know we're all trying to impress the scouts, but come on, dog. What are we what are we talking about here? I'm only projected around 13! Oh! Go! Go! He missed it! I'm gonna get my first RBI! And a triple! Pure speed! What's that mean? Have a runner score from the first without... Oh, without leaving the field of play. Let's go! And speed or luck or both. Hit a triple. I'm getting trophies like crazy. An RBI triple, dog! It wouldn't have been a triple if he wouldn't have dove. I don't know what he was thinking there. But the catcher with a triple get us on the board. That's kind of embarrassing, dog. What are you doing, Jay Ju? Ray Ray Delgadio. Okay. What's he got? Has he got some pop? No, he sucks. God, the I don't know what MLB the show's CPU mechanics are, but every time you play like player lock or or road to show or anything and you're on base it's almost like the people forget how to play the rest of your teammates they always strike out or walk it's almost a guaranteed strike out or walk that's embarrassing okay nobody on i'm not prepared for the steal this time I'm, I'm ready to go it's a bunt get their juice oh uh, gotcha easy Triple with an RBI. That had to have raised my stock a little bit. They saw my speed. They saw my power. We got a runner on first again. Not swinging at that. You're going to have to raise that ball up a little bit if you want me to swing it. You're going to have to raise it up. You raise me up. No, not swinging at that either. Come on, Robbie. Come on, Rob. I got too good a vision to, to swing at that BS. Oh, come on. Really? You're going to walk me in the combine? You're going to walk me in the combine, dog. That's insane. No, I had red light all day, baby. Red light all day. I probably would have grounded to a double play if I would have swung at that. Let's see what he's got now. 3-1 count. Ooh, I got to take the bat, the bat off the shoulders there. I got to take the bat off the shoulders. That's my bad. Hmm. I hate myself, dog. What am I doing? I struck out. I had a 3-0 count. That's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. I cannot believe I struck out there. Man, that's tough. That's tough. These guys don't seem to want to pitch to me. It's kind of crazy. I guess they know that I'm the most dangerous player on this team. As told by that triple that I just hit earlier. Ooh, that was close. I almost wanted to swing at that. I really did, as by my uh, check swing there. Am I going to get a pitch that I can actually swing at? What are you doing? 3-1 count. I'm not going to fumble this like I did the last at bat. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, very late? Really? Oh, uh, that's just, uh, that's just me not being able to, or not having played MLB The Show in a while. The timing will come back. That's a nice little base hit. One out base hit, down by four. There we go. Good job, Juice. Okay. So we're on base, one out, bottom nine. We need Jeju to do something here. He's going to put that in the outfield. What's he got? What's he got? All right. A little bit of a first to third action. I'll take that. Thank you, Jeju. 
Ray Delgadio. He struck out last time. We were <laughs> we saw him, so I don't have very much enthusiasm or hope for him. Oh my god, this guy sucks. Get him out of here. Give him a, a job in like a cubicle or something. This dude cannot play baseball. How did he even get invited here? He's not on my level. Bases loaded, two down, bottom nine. This could tie the game right here. If Dick Boyle, what a name by the way, can hit a home run here, this is tie ball game. Oh, he sucks. Wow, what a what a BS way to lose the game. But I had a triple. That gets us to round nine, and there's a lot more teams interested. The Giants, the Padres, the Royals, the Twins, the Cubs, the Blue Jays, the Yankees. Some new teams that are interested in your boy. You love to see it. We are going to jump to game number three and see how we can do. See if we can improve even further. Hello and welcome to day four of the MLB Draft Combine from the desert. I'm Ben Gelman. One final opportunity for promising prospects to showcase their skills as draft day approaches. The final day that we can do this, I don't know what's coming up after this, but right now we sit at projected round number nine, which is not that bad. Projected round number nine is not that bad, but I want to be invited to the the actual draft. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. This These pitchers are just so scared. Here we go. I hate you! I mean myself. I was... Oh, I hate that. Okay. Let's do this. 3-1 count. He doesn't have a fastball, which throws me off. I don't know if that would have been called a strike or not. It's tough to say. But now it's a full count. Does he go cutter again? Oh, that's got some pop to it. Ah. Uh, finally, I put the ball deep into the air, though. Or deep into the outfield. That's nice. All right, we got a chance for a steal situation. I'm ready for it this time. I'm actually paying attention. And he's going to go. No chance. You're gunned out. He's safe. Okay. Okay. He had a little bit more speed. A little bit more speed. At least I threw it to the right guy this time. <laughs> I didn't completely fumble it. Oh, man. I am not getting drafted, am I? Come on. Come on, Juice. Figure it out. There we go. Nice base hit. Nice knock. Into right field. There we go. That's how you get on base, baby. That's how you do that. Steal. What's with this first base uh, umpire or first base coach saying to steal? I'm 60 speed. I ain't got the, the speed to do that. What are we talking about here? I mean, I'll try it. It's on you if I get caught, though, dog. Get there. Get there. Get there. What? I actually stole a base with 60 speed? This catcher's worse than I am. He's got a noodle. He's got an absolute noodle. 2-2 two, two count. Come on, Yerbina. Oh, you suck. Get off the field, dog. You do not belong here. You suck. You haven't hit a base hit since I've been on the, the field. Oh, God. I hope that guy gets drafted in the 1800th round. Oh my god, what kind of teammates do I have here? I guess this is this is good because the scouts are going to be like, oh, this guy carried the team when he had nobody. There was nobody else helping him, so maybe that'll help me out. Oh my, three straight strikeouts? <laughs> help me. Help me. Ooh, is this going to be another steal situation? Maybe a double, what's going to happen here? Oh, good God. Oh, it's going to be a throw to the home situation. That's what it is. He's going to go? Oh, dog, you're out. You're out like a light. Bye-bye. That's tough. That's got a lot of resistance to it. I'm trying to pull that as fast as I can. but All right, that was a good little showing. I, I tagged him out at home. Didn't allow the run. And we're actually up in this game, finally. And a guy that has a fastball, which is nice. Oh, that was a good contact, but not... Not a base hit. Mm. That's tough. That's tough. Is this going to be a pop-up or something? 
Wade Outlaw, what a name. Oh no, it's gonna be another bunt situation. And I'm going to gun you out by a mile. Bye bye Single in the fourth. I gotta do something, dog. I gotta get extra base hits, home run, something. I gotta impress these boys. Five foot eleven. What kind of pitcher is five foot eleven? Why did I swing? I hate you, myself. No, it wasn't beautiful. I never would have should have swung at that. That was a horrible pitch. Ah! Very late on the curve, too. Man, I am not getting drafted very high, am I? Is he gonna steal third? No, he's not. Oh, it's gonna be a pop-up back to me. Oh, look at the athleticism! Look at the boy! The athleticism from the boy! That was pretty awesome. Bottom of the ninth. A steal. 96 speed. You think I'm gonna gun this guy out? I got no shot. I might not even... Might as well not throw it. I'm not gonna gun down a 96 speed, dude. I was just joking in the, the warm-ups. Alright, we won. I got one hit. I didn't look that impressive. Ugh, round eight. Oh, that's embarrassing. I don't see any new teams interested in me. We got a lot of the teams, though. All right, I guess we'll see what happens now. Ooh, what's this? Stephanie Saunders, okay. Hey, Juice, how's my favorite client? I, I don't know, Stephanie, I've never talked to you before. Uh, hi, Stephanie, a bit disappointed at my combine performance. Uh, I am a little bit disappointed by my combine performance. I'll just say, hey, what's up? Well, I don't think you performed quite up to your potential at the combine, but you still had a good showing. Oh, disrespectful. I can say it. You can't. I'm hearing that we should expect to, for you to be drafted somewhere between round 6 and 14. That's a wide range there, Steph. I was expected to be drafted much earlier. Yeah, I was definitely expected to be drafted much earlier than that. Undervaluing you a bit. Okay. Whatever. Being under so motivates me. No worries. The team that drafts me will be lucky to have me. I'm going to prove that I'm one of the best players in the class, dog. You just watch. I believe in you, and I know you're going to do big things. By the way, we can't really determine which team will draft you, but I'm curious if you have a team preference. Uh, let Destiny decide. I don't want to... As long as it's not the Marlins, because that's where I seem to go all the time. I want to play for the team that wants me the most. I don't want to pick it. Well, I can't guarantee anything, but I have a feeling you're going to end up in a great spot. Uh, but we'll just have to wait and see what happens. Thanks, Steph. Even though I never met you before. <laughs> Somehow you're my agent. All right. Man, that's upsetting. I really wanted to do better. I really did. Oh, what's they got? Whoa! They got a little walkout animation? That's kind of clean. Why can't the NFL do this? 13th pick of the 8th round. The Guardians! Well, that's something new. I've never been drafted by the Guardians before. I've been drafted by the Guardians. What's your reaction? Uh... Let's go excited. We don't want to be disrespectful right now. We can be disre disrespectful later. <laughs> the Guardians, okay. Oh, I get the little hat too? And an awkward high five? All right, hometown team. Not my favorite team, but in Ohio, get to stay local. All right, so another player that we saw at the MLB Draft Combine, off the board in the middle rounds of this year's draft. What's the reaction here to this pick? Starting with you, Sarah. Well, this player had a pretty good combine, but not the absolute best we've ever seen. I think there were some questions, but there's a lot of metrics that show there will be upside here. So I'm very excited to see how this player progresses through the minors. Yeah, I agree with Sarah completely, Robert. Uh, there are some question marks, but I do see upside. What I also see is a really good floor for this individual player. And, you know, guys with good floors sometimes end up being some of the better players that come out of the draft. All right, that's a little promising. Round eight, that's just a little frustrating, though. Hey, Juice, congrats on being drafted. I couldn't be happy for you. Thanks, Steph, I guess. Uh, how do you feel about being the newest member of the Guardians franchise? Uh, it's not my first choice, but I'll make it work. Yeah, it's not my first choice. I wouldn't really go to the Guardians first, but not my first choice. Sorry to hear not your top preference, but I'm happy to stay positive about the situation. Uh, I know I can make it work even if I don't like it. That's the right attitude. I'm sure organization will appreciate your professionalism. They are very lucky to have you. Uh, by the way, how are you feeling about your draft position? I feel like I should have been drafted earlier, obviously. We talked about this earlier. <laughs> yeah, you definitely went later than I was hoping. Yeah, you said round 6 to 14. Where's the 6? <laughs> I'm surprised since you had a solid performance in the combine. 
It's okay though. Now here's your chance to prove your true value at the professional level. Uh, yeah, I'm ready to get to work. I'm excited for you. Thank you. I've talked to the Guardians. They told me you'll be starting at the AA level with the Akron Rubber Ducks. I've actually watched a few of their games. I've gone to some of their games. Uh, keep doing what you do to stay at the top of your game mentally and physically. Okay. Then you'll be uh, good to go when you report to Akron in April. Uh, yes, ma'am, I'll be ready. Cool, I got this. Thanks, Steph. I appreciate you. We, I don't I don't really appreciate it right now. Uh, I'll have my manners. Yes, ma'am, I'll be ready. Might as well have our manners. We don't, we don't want to be uh, uh, disrespectful too early on. We can be disrespectful later. Ooh, look at the rubber duckies. We're on the rubber duck. I'm just glad the Marlins didn't pick me. I've been drafted by the Marlins way too many times in these. Juice Fisher, let me officially welcome you to the rubber ducks. I'm excited. I'm excited to be a rubber ducky. You ready to put in some serious work? Heck yeah, baby. Heck yeah. What else we got? Nick Daniels is his name. Good. Glad to hear it. In the minors, you get what you put in. Work hard. Don't give me any problems and you'll be fine. I'd rather be in the majors, but that's okay. And don't forget to work with your teammates. Help them to be their best and they'll do the same for you. Uh, they suck. You don't have to worry about me. I don't plan on being down here <laughs> in double A very long. Let's go with that. Let's be confident. Let's be confident. Maybe a little dickish. What's he got to say about that? What's he going to say? He's just staring at me? Well, I hope your game is half as strong as your confidence. I guess we'll find out. Oh, we will. We will, rubber ducky coach. We will. That's it for now. Good luck out there, Juice. I don't need luck. I'm talented. All right. We've been drafted officially. This screen is bright, by the way. We have been drafted officially on the team, the rubber duckies. We will see how long we stay here. Next episode will be the debut of the Juice in the minor leagues. I'm super excited about it. I hope you guys are too. If you are, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, join the Juice Club. Thank you so much for stopping by and watching. I truly appreciate it. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.